Hi, my name is Jonathan, and I would like to invite all Roman Catholics into the Holy Apostolic Orthodox Church. Because I believe in the not too distant future, the entire Roman Catholic Church is going to collapse. And there are actually a lot of Eastern Orthodox prophecies to that effect, that in the last days, the Roman Catholic Church will completely break up and just fall apart. So because I do not want Roman Catholics as like sheep without a shepherd, um, we welcome you into the Orthodox Church. Um, and a lot of Catholic popes over the last few decades, they've been trying to reunite the Church, especially trying to reunite the Orthodox Church into the Roman Catholic Church, um, essentially trying to have the, Catholic, the Orthodox Church under Roman papacy. But I believe the opposite will happen where the Roman Catholic Church will fall apart and the Orthodox Church will absorb Catholics um, into the Orthodox Church. So we, you will be reunited with us um, in the future. And I think that the sex abuses and corruption today in, in the Catholic Church, these are just the, it's just the crack in the dam. I'm not sure what's going to happen because God has told me the same thing, that the Roman Catholic Church is going to fall apart, but I'm not sure what's going to happen. So the corruption and sex abuse is just the cracks in the dam. And we actually have less in incidences of sex abuse in the Orthodox Church because most of our priests are married and because a priest is supposed to model the sacrament of marriage. So that's why most priests are married. So less incidences of sex abuse. And we as Orthodox Christians, we as the Orthodox Church, need your social justice. Because I love how Roman Catholics are very passionate about social justice, which is a little bit lacking in the Orthodox Church. So if you leave the Catholic Church when it breaks apart, um, if you leave without going to another organized religion, social justice will suffer because of that. Because social justice, in, need, in order to thrive and be effective, needs a large group of organized people, especially in the context of a religion. So please, we welcome you to the Orthodox Church because we need your passion for social justice. And I promise you that the Orthodox Church um, is, will remain strong. The, the Orthodox Church is invincible um, in contrast to other denominations and within Christianity. Because we as Orthodox Christians believe that divine authority, the divine authority of the apostolic tradition is primarily given by the Holy Spirit and only secondarily given by um, church authority through apostolic succession. It's like a little graph um, comparing and contrasting orthodoxy and Roman Catholicism. In, in the Roman Catholic Church, the outer circle represents church authority and priests and all that. Whereas the inner circle, though it's not too far apart, from um, the outer circle. The inner circle represents apostolic tradition. That's the model in the, the Catholic Church. But in the Orthodox Church, the outer circle is apostolic tradition, and the inner circle is church authority and um, apostolic succession. Because in our worldview as Orthodox Christians, apostolic tradition is essentially the Holy Spirit. And it, apostolic tradition is something so much more greater than the church itself. So, like, with the Orthodox Church and the Orthodox um, structure is patterned after heaven, essentially. Um, that is our understanding as Orthodox Christians. That every, the, the Orthodox Church is patterned after everything that's in, in heaven. Um, so anyway, we welcome you into the Orthodox Church when the Catholic Church falls apart. And regardless, we do love you. And that's all I wanted to say. Bye.